Hello everyone. Welcome to another informative episode on White Davy Gardening and Worm Farm. Today we're going to be discussing 10 reasons why your leaves curl. The first is spider, sorry, aphids. And these will cause yellow spots on your leaves. They will cause wilting of the leaves. And if the aphids release a virus on the plant, then your leaves can become, can develop mold on it. This can be treated with diatomaceous earth, crushed eggshell, mag um, potassium salt. You can use neem oil or peppermint oil to treat these and you do this every five to seven days. Spider mites are another problem. And these can be red, green, yellow, or other color. And these are tiny insects. The symptoms are pale specks on your leaves, or you will see webbing on your plants. The webbing can be on the leaves or on the stem of the plants. So you can treat spider mites with peppermint oil. You can use neem oil. You can use diatomaceous earth, uh, crushed eggshell or potassium salt. You can also use chrysanthemum leaves or the flowers crushed and soaked in water for 24 hours. And then this is sprayed onto the plant. The neem oil and the peppermint oil inhibits the growth of pests on your plants, whereas the diatomaceous earth and the potassium salts cut through their waxy layer and dehydrates them. The next reason why your leaves curled are thrips. These are brown or silver in color and they leave white strips on your plants. The leaves may become crumbly before they fall off. So when you have thrips, then this can be treated with neem oil. It can be treated with peppermint oil. And this works pretty well. The next reason why your leaf curl, the fourth reason is white flies so the symptoms of white fly is that the leaves or the plant become stunted or twisted white spots or mold develops on the leaves these can be treated by using neem oil or peppermint oil to treat them you can use diatomaceous earth crush eggshell or use a hose to spray them off the leaves. These creatures like to be on the underside of the leaves. Now the fifth reason why your leaves curl is powdery mildew. The symptoms are grayish white powder on your leaves, especially young leaves. Blisters on the edges of the leaves will occur as well. So to treat this, you may need to use apple cider vinegar. So you're going to get two teaspoons of apple cider vinegar per quart of water. Anything else will be too strong and damage your plant. You want to make sure that you have the appropriate spacing for your plants in order to reduce the risk of having powdery mildew. Now the sixth reason why your plant leaves will curl is nitrogen deficiency, which usually starts at the lower level of your plant and gradually work its way up. So you want to start by treating the nitrogen deficiency you can use for a quick fix comfrey tea or grass clipping soaked in water
fish emulsion is another source of nitrogen that you can use to add nitrogen to your plants. The seventh reason is phosphorus deficiency. Lower leaves become dark bluish green and shiny and you will have splashes of brown throughout your leaves if this is prolonged. So to correct this problem then you need to treat it with bone meal or you can use fish emulsion as well to solve this problem. The next problem is potassium deficiency. So unlike phosphorus and nitrogen, this occurs all over the plant. And it is a yellowish brown, very bright yellow or a very bright brown or a combination. So this can be treated by crushing or blending ripe banana in water and soak it for 24 hours, then spray it onto your plants. This solution, you want to add molasses to it because the molasses helps the plant to absorb the nutrients from the banana skin. The ninth reason is eat stress. So the leaves will curl upwards if the leaves, even if the plant is in the shade because of the heat stress. And the leaves won't change color unless the situation is severe. So to correct this problem, you want to use shade cloth to cover it. Now shade cloth come in various grade. So if the shade cloth is said to be 60%, it means that it resists 60% of the heat from the sun. For indoor garden, you can always use a fan to help to cool your plants down. Now the tenth reason why plant leaves curl is because of overwatering. The leaves will start drooping when you overwater them and if it is seedlings then root rot will occur very quickly. You will start to see the seedlings start to thin, the stem of the seedlings start to thin close to the ground. To correct this problem, stop watering the plants and allow the soil to dry out. Then gradually start watering again controlling the volume of water that you use. So these are the 10 reasons why plants leaves will curl. So your aphids, spider mites, white flies, thrips, powdery mildew, nitrogen deficiency, potassium deficiency, phosphorus deficiency, heat stress, and overwatering. Did you find this video informative? Would you like to learn more? If so, why not take a moment to like, share, and subscribe to my channel, and turn on your notification for more updates like these. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have yourself a wonderful day.